Hi, welcome back to my channel. Before I proceed, I just want to say Happy Lunar New Year or Happy Chinese New Year depending on where you are at. For me, it has been it has been three years. I haven't seen my family because of the situation we are in. So it, it is a tough situation and I definitely feel homesick about it. But oh well, I is it's New Year for for Asians, so I want to keep the spirit up. So to distract myself, I went to the coach store and came back with this. So <laughs> this today's unboxing would be Coach Gotham Tall Tote. It's the new tote from their retail collection. Originally, I wasn't sure that I wanted to get it because on the website, the picture just look kind of it, the picture just doesn't look as good, and the dimension make the bag look kind of squarish, and I'm not sure that is a proportion that good for the bag that would match up my style. So, but when I went into the store, I found the bag looks better than than on the website. That's why I decided to get it. Let's take it out. So the SA working at the store doing a good job packing up this box for me. I like how everything put together and I know I always talk about check your bag before you going home but I actually forgot to take a look before they pack it up. Hopefully it wasn't a, a return or something so hopefully everything looks good with this unboxing. So, And also one of the reasons I decided to get this bag is because January is is my birthday month, so to, it would be the last day for me to to use the ten percent birthday discount from Coach. To be honest, I do think the price is a little bit high for this for this thought for it what it is, but. It is a design and a style that I love, so I decided to just go for it as a way to celebrate Lunar New Year. So removing the ribbon. I love when they pack your purchase nicely and beautifully. It has this coach uh, horse and carriage sticker. I can take it out sideways. Look like they're putting it in a dust bag for me. This dust bag is kind of smooth, silky texture. It's a good size dust bag. And here you go. This is their Coach Gotham Tall Tote. It has this signature ladder. Let's take a closer look. I'm going to show you the texture on the side as well. I like that the signature logo pattern on this ladder is kind of make it more like a pattern than than shouting the brand in your face kind of feeling but the bag itself it doesn't have a doesn't have a fit though but it does have a ladder i think this look like extra piece of leather at the bottom to reinforce the shape 
As you can see here, the side of this kind of warp a little bit. Yeah, it's kind of warp a little bit, but I think I'll just just take it as it is because if you touch this back, you would know that the leather is actually very soft. So even though I want it to be a structure or I love a structure bag, I know this bag eventually will turn into a kind of a slightly slouchy style of bag because the leather itself is very soft. It's a soft pebble leather. And they come with this handle, very comfortable to carry. I do notice that sometimes when back handle is thicker, the, the width is thicker, it's actually harder for the hand to grab on it. And this is a kind of a good size handle. On the side, it has this D ring for you to hook on the cross body strap. And it's good that it's not, it's not a fixed strap that on the back. A lot of time, the, the, the cross body strap or the shoulder strap on men's back, usually they are fixed on it. And I, I tend to prefer the removable one. That way, you can switch it up, make it more fun or make it your own style instead of stuck with it. Sometimes, I'm re I was really tempted to just cut the strap. I don't know if you ever feel, feel like that. Sometimes you love the bag, but the strap is just, just not, not quite your cup of tea and you feel like, almost feel like, oh, I want to cut off the strap. Let's take off this. So on the top, it does have uh, this zipper closure and it is a full leather bag. So let me get the box off. So on the top, it does have this leather zipper closure. It's full leather, even the the zipper closure is made with leather. But however, inside of the bag is lined with fabric. It's not lined with leather. So that's where I feel like the, the price for this bag is higher. I almost feel like they price this bag based on the inflation and based on their price increase instead of the value of this bag. I have a feeling that this bag will eventually get on the discount page, but not sure when. When that happens, I probably will get a few more because I do like this style a lot. And they also come with the smooth, not smooth, but pebble leather without this signature C pattern on it. I believe they have the pebble leather in black. And I think they call it... I forgot what they call it, the kind of a cream color, like the dark color for LV and, and the yellow color, they call it canary. Let me take out the stuffing inside. Okay, I'm back after taking out all the stuffing and the strap. So, before we look inside the bag, here's the, the strap that came with it. I think this is kind of like gunmetal color. And the strap feel like it's kind of this smooth cotton blend webbing fabric. It's pretty thick. Definitely retail quality kind of thickness. So I do like that. I'm trying to show you inside of the bag. So, inside the bag, it has this story patch here and with this zipper pocket. Let's see how deep it is. It's not very deep. I would say about maybe 7 or 7 inches deep into pocket. Definitely not all the way to the bottom. And then on the other side, it has slip pocket, two, two bigger size slip pocket, and one smaller size. Hopefully you can see it, the, 
the stuffing is still inside here. Small one, I'm not sure what you can do with it. Probably a pen. What else would fit in that? So other than that, it's basically empty inside. It's a it's a fabric lining. It feel kind of sway microfiber kind of fabric. It feel pretty soft. I have heard that some people don't like the the microfiber lining because they believe that in in long term the fabric may break down. I haven't had the experience that have the fabric broken down. So so far they have been held up for me. And so this is how the bag looks without stuffing. And I'm five nine, and this is how it looks on me. Also, one of the reasons I, I love this bag because it really reminded me the Louis Vuitton on the go that I have. It's, it's the same kind of a signature logo pattern, pebble leather, and similar kind of a structure tote. So, so here is the comparison. So I'll get closer for you to see the different texture. The leather on Louis Vuitton almost almost feel like small. It has a smaller grain, and the one on Coach is has bigger bigger grain. So it's softer for this Coach tote, and for the on the go, the leather is more stiff and more structured. Eventually. This on-prem leather will, will soften as well, but for now, it still feels more structure. As you can see, the, the, side, the side structure is pretty similar, except for the on-the-go, it has this reinforcement leather tab here. And I like that on the on-the-go, they, they sew the leather fold in so you don't have the glazing problem or glazing cracking problem so for coach bag it's all glazing and i'll be honest with you the craftsmanship is okay not like the best best glazing i have seen so if I have to give it a score, I would say the glazing is maybe 7 out of 10. I think because they cut directly using this kind of a texture ladder and it has this unevenness from the, the, the logo pattern. So when they do the glazing, it, it could be more challenging for them to keep the glazing evenly. So this is my unboxing and review and and a quick comparison quick comparison with the on the go. So if you are looking for alternative on the go alternative, you could consider this coach signature ladder Gotham Tall Tote. It's new and I do like the design and I do like that it, it has this zipper closure on top so it will be great for work or everyday out. It's not too big, not too small. So thanks for watching my unboxing today and I'll talk to you again soon and enjoy your holiday, enjoy your Lunar New Year holidays. Bye.